Hi, everyone! Yesterday, a dear viewer of mine asked me in comment to make a video about the Oki Card event game. She mentioned that she doesn't even knew that she could get so much rewards during the Tombola event, which you find inside of the item shop. If you'd like to hear more about the Tombola system, about this item shop event, then feel free to watch my previous video, which I posted yesterday. Now, it's time to speak about the Oki card game event. So first of all, this event usually lasts for four weeks, 25 to 35 days. There is two Oki card events each year, one during the summer, one during the winter. Winter Oki chests contains the following ones. Summer Oki chests contains the following ones. Please keep in mind that I only showed you the silver Oki chest rewards, since you'll get those most likely and most of the buyers only buys those silver oaky chests. I'll show you the gold oaky rewards too in one picture. So, I show you in one picture why players buys these chests at all. Players buys winter oaky chests for the magic stones. That's the easiest way to get hundreds of magic stones fast and easily. Summer oaky chests contains amulets like Ring of Joy, which gives you 30% power against monsters. It lasts for seven days. So if you buy a few thousands of summer silver oaky chests, you'll have enough for a few months or maybe for years. As you can see, you can even buy oaky boxes from the item shop so you can obtain oaky card decks to play for dragon coins. But I recommend you to do not buy these boxes from the item shop. Go to SD3. There, with 300% chance of double drop bonuses, you might farm each hour 15 to 30 OK cards. When I were farming there, I were capable to collect each hour 17 to 23 Oki card decks. With my budget weapon Sura build, which I showed you already in one of my previous video. Why do I use Bandicam Recorder now? There is a reason for that, because you has to see what I see, so you'll understand how you can become a more successful Oki card player. You'll understand how could you make way more silver Oki chests than before, way more silver chests than bronze chests. So listen carefully. So first of all, there is two helpful tools to make way more silver ones than bronze ones. Let's start with the first one, which I used in the past. Excel. Open your Excel. Go to the ninth line. Here set the following three bars, color to one red, one blue, one yellow as you want. It's totally up to you. Using this tool is useful, especially if you want to help for one of your friend so they can tell you which card have they dropped away, and you'll see exactly what they see. And you'll know the best options they could do in order to make a silver or gold oaky chest. But remember, for this event you need luck too. A bit luck, not too much. I mean, all you have to do is accept that some of the games might be very unlucky. But out of ten game, there is only one to three. The rest seven or nine can be at least silver oaky chest. So, whenever you drop away an Oki card, do a favor for yourself and document it to the Excel bars. For an example, as you can see, I put it down the red 6 and red 5 and red 4, so I documented it. From now on, I know that I can't make a red 876. So I can decide, will I drop away the red 8 and red 7, or will I go for red 8, blue 8, yellow 8, red 7, blue 7, yellow 7? It depends on. In this case, I could put down blue 6, blue 5, blue 4, too. We will say, All you have to do is keep documenting and keep foreshadowing the possibly options to reach 300 points to get silver Oki at least. In this video, I'll play away 9 Oki card set card decks. I would say that you should make out of 100 Oki card set at least 6 silver Oki chest, 1 gold Oki chest, and 3 bronze chest. If these are the numbers you produce, then you do something way better than most of the players do. 60% of your rewards should be silver chests, 5% to 10% gold chest, and the rest is bronze. Accept it. You can't do nothing against that. Option 2. Open your browser. Type the following one. Meetin' 2 Oki Card Helper. Open the first one or the second one. It's up to you. Once you've finished, refresh the page with button F5. I like this option more than Excel, actually. From now on, there will be silence. Feel free to scroll to the end of the video if you are only curious about the results.
As you can see, playing away nine Oki card sets took me 10 to 15 minutes. It would be faster if I could play away five at a moment, like I did during Winter Oki event. Out of the nine Oki card set, I made six silver Oki chests and three bronze one. I almost made one gold Oki chest, since I reached 390 points. 400 points needed for gold Oki chests. Okay, that's all for today. I'll wish you good luck with farming and collecting Oki cards, and also, good luck with playing away your Oki card sets. I hope you'll make a few hundreds of silver chests, or even few thousands. Thanks for watching, and thank you for your support, everyone. I hope this video helped you a bit to understand more the Oki card event game. Also, please, whenever you farming Oki cards, farm on such a places where there is number three and number four after the monster's name, like in SD3, like at the end of the Red Forest, etc. If this video was useful for you, then please, do a favor for me. Subscribe to my channel, like the video, and comment. Let me know what would you love to see in the future. Making some of my educative videos takes me a few hours. Some shorter ones, like the yesterday one. Luckily, that one just costed me 30 to 60 minutes. But not this one. Take care. See you in the next video.